So I've got the code and I'm going in. So I'm in. All right. So um, I um, <coughs> excuse me. It's really cute so far. I had um, after I talked to you, Kevin. I looked this up to make sure I had the right number, and it's already gone active under contract. Active under contract means that it's under contract, but they're leaving it in active under contract status because there are contingencies on the contract usually of um, the financial contingency which could be 25 to 45 days and the inspection contingency period which is usually uh, 14 days maybe maybe 21 because they rent this a lot so those two contingencies, if anything were to fall through on those in that period of time for this um, contract, then uh, it would be put back on active. And so usually during uh, active under contract status, they do allow showings and they do allow backup offers. This is really cute. I can't figure out how to turn the light on, so I'm sorry, but um, this, um, it's decorated really cutely. Cutely, is that a word? I think so. And, um, you know, it's pretty well updated. Very cute. You know, this shower stall is probably original. The bathtub is original. Or shower stall, excuse me. Original shower stall. Um, pause it. Um, I don't have any paperwork with me in my hand, but I'm guessing this is around a thousand square feet, 1200 square feet, maybe. This is the secondary room. Can't turn the light on, but it's got a full size bed and a twin. Clearly this is already used as a rental. It's got, oh, I think we know that because it, it grossed like 45,000, I think, did it? Oops, sorry. This is like the bathroom for that secondary room, but it's also the powder room for the home. All right, the lights weren't already on, so. Kitchen has been updated nicely. Very, very cute. I I give this a thumbs up. I give it a thumbs up. The space is good. It's decorated very well. I'm sorry, I'm struggling to find the light switches for you. Um, okay. That's the little dining area. They have these cute stools that you can, so you can kind of prop yourself here. Um, you know, sit here and have your cereal or whatever in the morning. And then these units do have little balconies. This is that little outdoor balcony. Kind of looks out over, um, where am I? Okay, so that's, South Sea Pines Drive, right out there. And those units across the way, that's, um, those are, I had a friend that lived there. Um, it's escaped me at the moment, but I'll figure it out. And then this little window, that's South Sea Pines Drive. Oh, it's gonna drive me crazy. I can't think of the name of those villas over there. Uh, sound, sound villas, because they front the sound. The view you have from this condo building is just the parking lot there. But you know where you are in location to um, 
the beach, um, which can be accessed uh, past Sound Villas down to the right, there's a beach access. So you just walk across the street and then you know how close you are to um, Salty Dog and the marina and the shops and the restaurant and all that kind of stuff. So, um, you know, just on a quick glance here without looking at any paperwork, um, it, this is in good shape and, and I would give it a thumbs up. Um, and you know how honest I am, I would tell you otherwise. I think it's worth every penny of its asking price. So um, I'm gonna upload this to YouTube and send it to you. All right, hope your golf game's going well. Talk to you, bye.